So this video goes back to July 4th weekend uh, where we yeah, yeah. Uh, g went to our favorite place Shoshone Lake out here in the Wind River Mountains uh, in the Wind River Range uh, in Wyoming. But before I get on with that movie, I wanted to immortalize for ourselves uh, the trip that took place earlier. Uh, I think it was sometime in May when me, uh, uh, Mitch and I, uh, Mitch in the, in the Jeep and um, I was uh, obviously in the Toyota, went to, to do some snow wheeling and uh, Mitch's friend uh, Bobby um, <laughs> did something that I wanted to uh, to remember uh, uh, in the future. Uh, so here, here, here it goes, uh, we were just um, climbing this uh, this mountain uh, it was uh, fairly challenging the ground was uh, really soft and uh, the snow uh, it was that spring snow really heavy uh, really wet snow um, gives you attraction if you um, lower the tire pressure but uh, uh, of course, the the best uh, vehicles for for those purposes are the lighter ones, and the Jeep went did fairly good, fairly good. Here, Mitch was uh, playing around. Everything was going good. Um, we were progressing along, but then the snow started getting uh, deeper, and at some point, uh, Mitch, I guess at that time he hasn't driven in the snow. I guess he has driven in the snow plenty, but uh, from year to year, some of the skills are get getting f are forgotten. So he was a little bit too happy um, at some uh, at some point. He started getting uh, too happy with the accelerator pedal, and so I hooked him up, pulled him back, and then uh, um, I decided not to remove the rope. Uh, from the G uh, from uh, not to un un unhook it from the Toyota and just wrap it around my lights. So a while later, um, Mitch got stuck again. So Bobby help helpfully um, um, decided to hook up uh, the the truck, which he did. Uh, he uh, unwinded the rope or connected to the jeep and uh, I gave Mitch the go-ahead and what happened next is uh, will live with us uh, forever at least <laughs> on this video so yeah Bobby forgot to remove the last loop of the rope from the lights and uh, they uh, took a dive anyway uh, the rest of the day was uh, pretty nice we had lunch uh, grilled some uh, burgers uh, did some warm wheeling and uh, came back um, bef before the nightfall it was, overall it was a pretty good day um, but anyway uh, shit happens I suppose uh, so um, back to to the video that uh, uh, that was taken uh, later on in July. Mitch's co-worker uh, CJ and uh, his family, I guess uh, uh, every 4th fourth, uh, fourth of July they come to Shoshone Lake, so we decided to hook up with them. Um, they were all kind of taking their time, so we got ahead uh, and uh, got to the almost to the top of the pass before they showed up. And uh, the first uh, vehicle that showed up was uh, CJ's sister on uh, this uh, late 80s uh, uh, CJ7. Well, mid 80s. I guess the last year that they were producing them was, I believe, was uh, 86. Uh, completely stock. Um, might be oversized tires, but uh, nothing down to the drivetrain, uh, no traction aids, but it did uh, remarkably well. Um, there is a reason why Jeeps are legendary, especially um, of that vintage. This Jeep can fly. 
next to show up was uh, 80s uh, Cherokee driven by CJ's brother-in-law and um, uh, it, it, it was it had opened uh, differential but uh, really flex a suspension uh, so it, it has that advantage comparing to the following Jeep that belongs to CJ uh, his suspen sus suspension is not as strict out, but um, he does have uh, limited slips or maybe even uh, uh, automatic lockers, don't remember. Both of them are very, very uh, impressive, especially uh, pulling, both of them were pulling trailers as it's going seen on the video. Um, but really, really nice and uh, basically uh, I'm going to shut up from here on and uh, let everybody enjoy uh, the action just wanted to make a little uh, comments about uh, the setup of those jeeps So just give it a little bit of a bump and it'll go. You'll go over. CJ's Jeep had a little bit of a problem with wiring uh, after struggling a little bit uh, with lack of power because of uh, I think the wiring was uh, getting heat up and anyway it was uh, fixed and from then on it uh, it, it was uh, doing just fine.
friends.